Yeah. And one thing I would like to appreciate from many political parties is that they have actually reduced the fees for women uh, and uh, persons with disability who are coming into uh, this race. So whatever a man is paying, the women are paying half the price. That is a very good gesture for the leadership of those political parties, which is like almost all political parties. So that is very encouraging. That is, I believe, is uh, something being offered now. But once we become uh, many in parliament, then I don't think that kind of offer will be there. Secondly, the, this current parliament have failed because uh, there was a two-thirds majority, that, uh, the two-thirds gender rule that was supposed to have been implemented. And I remember this, the outgoing CJ or the CJ who left, that is CJ Maraga, actually said that this parliament to be dissolved because they have not made the two-thirds majority. We are coming to an election now. And in this election, if we can get more women into parliament, then we kill that problem that we have of the two-thirds majority. This is where there is a woman, there is proper leadership. Aldai can attest to it because when the former MP, Dr. Sally Kosge, was in power, I think everybody here and everybody to date remembers what, the, what she did. I would like to bring back that kind of leadership. I would like to help that allied people so that in five years' time, they will be speaking and saying there was a lady who helped uplift and die. So to the ladies and to the women folk, the time is now.